everyone, it's Jean Hansen, co-founder of the janitorialstore.com and myhousecleaningbiz.com. So we were recently had a discussion in one of our online discussion groups about safety and just what it costs when an employee gets an injury. Because there's more to the injury than just the medical bills, right? Eventually, you're probably going to have a cost, um, an increase in your workers' comp insurance. There could be an increase in the modification rate. And then there's all those other things like loss of productivity and things like that that you have to consider. And so I actually found an online calculator that does a really good job of really drilling down to what the cost is for your business. So I'm going to switch over. And just to share, this comes from Safety Management Group. Uh, this is their calculator. And this uh, in here, it says, as an example, the, a cost of a $2,500 clinic visit could easily end up costing your business $10,000 in indirect costs like on things like productivity, loss of productivity, administrative time, insurance increases, OSHA involvement, and so forth. So in the example that they have here, it's a $48,000 direct cost of injury. They're saying that $38,000 is an average work-related injury. So then you calculate the indirect cost of the injury. So your total cost is $240,000. And then if you have, if you, if your business makes about a 10% profit margin, it's actually going to take you $2,400,000 in revenue to offset the loss. Now that's huge, but I want to take a, a smaller example. So let's say that you had an employee um, in your cleaning business that had a minor injury. Maybe it's a sprained ankle or uh, something like that, or a slip fall injury. Well, the indirect cost of that could be as high as $10,000 for a total cost of $12,500. So suddenly your $2,500 injury is about $12,500 when you consider all the other factors. And if you have that 10% profit margin, it's going to take you $125,000 in revenue to just to offset that loss of a $2,500 injury. So think about that because that's really important to consider uh, when you are thinking about safety training for your employees. I know some companies that don't even offer safety training, and that's so important in this industry because it's one of the most um, highly um, injury-prone industries that there is out there outside of construction. So it's something that's very important to your cleaning business. Now, we do have safety training that is available for just for cleaning companies, um, uh, both on myhousecleaningbiz.com and the janitorialstore.com. So you'll find our safety training there, and I'll put a link below this video. Thanks, and see you next time.